From the day the Living Arts Center opened, it struggled to gain its footing. It was such a unique facility, people didn't know what to make of it, and all the LAC had to offer. Ron Lennock, the current CEO, gave credit to Jerry Townsend for being a guiding light and leading the Living Arts Center on to a path of prosperity. Well, without, without Jerry Townsend, uh, this Living Arts Center could still have a problem. It was really easy becoming CAO after his eight years because everything's in place. All the rules are here and governance is here. We do everything by the book from a committee members to, to, uh, we're, uh, to the board of directors. We're a study in governance and, and that's all because Jerry established it that way. The LAC offers so many options for so many people Sometimes it's hard to grasp how many functions flow through this remarkable venue every day. Our best kept secret is the attendance. I know I stood out in the hallway one day in the atrium with somebody that said, you know, it's never busy here. There were 3,000 people inside the Living Arts Center. You know, 1,500 in, uh, or 1,300 in, the, uh, in Hammerson. There was a, another 400 in, in the Royal Bank Theater and there were people in all the courses, people in all the course rooms. People don't understand how busy we really are. The Mississauga Board of Trade is proud to present the 2013 Not-for-Profit Award of Excellence to the Living Arts Center. Mm -hmm.